Hi guys, welcome to my art channel. It's Angela Bliss, and today we are swiping. Um, I'm so glad you're here, and I'm gonna get you down on the table here in a minute. I just wanted to say we thank you so much for being here on our Thursday night Rock and Pour collaborations. Um, I hope that you started and uh, went all the way through. If you didn't, Louise McKay Art. She has the greatest functional art ever. Please check her channel out. Subscribe, like, and share. Lori Houston Art, Flower Pop Queen. And she just started blooming on glass and I'm like taken back. I just love her work. Um, so please check her out. Subscribe, like, comment, share. Comment on Louise's too, don't forget. Don't leave anybody out. And of course, Amber's Awfully Awesome Art. Amber. I've said it before and I'll say it again. Everything she touches turns to gold. She is such an intellect when it comes to remembering detail and techniques once she's learned them. And she will follow them to the T. And if she's not happy, she's gonna scrape it and start over. Um, so I applaud her for that. Usually I kind of just work through until I get something I like and hopefully you do too. But anyway, um, so I'm here to do a swipe. I'm going to use some colors that I had mixed up already. So I will not have a color list for you. I'll try to remember as I go through the video, I think, what I used and what I mixed together. But I can't wait to show you guys this. So stay tuned um, again. If you like what you see, please leave me a like, um, comment, and subscribe to my channel. We have plenty more where this is coming from, and I will see you on the other side of this. So you guys take care, be safe, love one another, and let's get down. Hello everyone, and welcome to my channel, Angel Bliss Art. I'm Angela Bliss, and uh, I'm going to be doing a swipe of any kind in this collaboration. So I have mixed um, some house paint. It's the Walmart Color Place in black. And I added some Gek 800 to it. And I'm sure I have too much. I'm just gonna lay it on this canvas. It's a 12 by 24. Now make me a little puddle. I'm gonna do some swiping, do some uh, modifying, some tilting, and see what we get. I hope you guys are well today and are excited about this collaboration. And I'm sure everyone else brought some really awesome swipes, so I can't wait to see them. Okay, so I have some Artist Loft black and artist loft white mixed with Floetrol and Liquitex gloss medium. And I've made two cups and I'm going to just kind of wring them together here. So I'm just putting some titanium white mixed with Australian Floetrol on my palette knife. I save enough to go over my, I have some colors that I'm gonna add. And my colors are just leftover colors that I had from previous projects. And they're actually bloom paints that I've just kind of thinned down a little bit. So let's go over right there. Let's do that again. Um, let's go.
I'm going to use it in a minute. All of the paints that I'm using and how I mix them will be in the description box. Um, some of the colors will not be listed um, because some of them are kind of mixed together. Um, if I can remember which ones they were, I will uh, state it in the video. If I can't, I will also state it in the video. So I have um, a permanent blue violet mixed with sangria, TLP maybe, I think. And I'm going to swipe some colors down here. So, uh, put that color right there. I don't have any spoons. Let me get some spoons. Okay. And the next color I have is going to be, it's like our Aztec Rad Raspberry and the Strawberry, Pearl Strawberry mixed together. It's like a mauvey color. I also have a May Spring pigment that I just used in a couple of pours. I have an Angel Orange and it's like a Horizon mixed together. And a Cobalt Turquoise. And another May Spring pigment that I used. Not sure, it was Mermaid something. Um, if I remember, I'll put it in the description box. And I have a Peridot by Deco Art and Grunge TLP mixed together. See, I remembered everything, almost. I'm not one to keep my pigments for, I mean my, uh, my balloon paints for very long. So I like to kind of use them and incorporate them in other things that I'm doing. So you will see me sometimes do that a lot on my channel. Okay, so I've got my titanium white and I'm going to swipe through this. Uh, I'm probably going to swipe through here and bring it maybe. We can work with that. That's nice. All right, so I'm going to wreck this a little bit. Let's give it a little movement. Okay, let's try this out. Don't think I need more paint. Um, I'm just gonna try to, yeah, maybe a little. I'm gonna have tons of paint come off though, so I tend to use too much paint. I think I say that in every one of my videos. Hopefully <laughs> don't you lose a lot of the pretty that I see. Okay, I think I do have two other videos that I did this with and I just absolutely love it and haven't really visited. It in like a year and uh, we were like swipe any kind of swipe so I was thinking back and thinking oh let me try that again because I've been wanting to so all right let's talk keep a lot of the purple because I really love it.
this just got really slow. Bring the purple back up. Oh, it's pretty. I really like that white lacing. Just looking at it. What do you guys think? You know, it should create a few more cells as it sits. May have to tilt it a little more, but it's beautiful. I love it. I'm going to pull a little bit of this green through here, and I wanted to show you guys. I just wanted a little bit more movement right there, and maybe right through this lump. There. There. I'm done. That's all I wanted to do. I'm not real happy about this and this, but I can live with it. Um, I love that we didn't swipe all of this away, these solid colors, and this is just amazing uh, detail. It's so pretty. And I love this right here on the edges, it's just swirled. And I love how the house paint and the Floetrol, the GAC 800, and the Liquitex, uh, the varnish, um, it just kind of mixes and makes its own thing with that Artist Loft paint. So yeah, really happy. Um, let me know what you guys think in the comments. Thank you for being here on our collaboration. And we will see you next week. Bye-bye for now. Stay tuned for all the results. Okay, guys, this is the dried result. It is absolutely, insanely gorgeous. That pure copper by Mainspring is just like, oh my God, it's so pretty. Um, I love it this way, but every way that I turn it, I love. It's just amazing. I'm definitely going to do a bigger one of these. This is 12 by 24. Um, I want to go bigger. Let me know what you guys think in the comments, but this is amazing. Amazing, amazing, amazing. I just love it. I'm gonna get you closer um, here in just a second, but I just wanted you to see the composition. So now we're going for a close up. Okay, so this is the composition that I love. It's so pretty. It's so black right there. And then it just kind of grays out where the white and the black mix together. So yeah, super happy with it. I just love this. Oh my gosh. I love it all, but it's so pretty. Please let me know what you guys think in the comments. Thank you so much for being with us this week. We appreciate it. We will be here next week. Same time, same place. See you then. Bye.